Electricity is one of the most powerful source of energy. Long ago, people lit fires to heat their homes, light up night and cook food. Today, all we have to do is put in a plug, flick a switch and energy is there. When two objects, balloon and hair rub against each other, some electrons in hair move to balloon, that produces static electricity, that's why hair stick to the balloon. Everything is made up of atoms and atoms are made up of electrons, protons and neutrons. Atoms have equal number of electrons and protons so they are electrically neutral. When an object gains electrons, it becomes negatively charged. When an object loses electrons, it becomes positively charged. Electrons and protons are charged particles. They can carry electrical energy. Movement of electrons produces electricity. Conductors have some free electrons, which can carry electricity, such as copper and zinc. Insulators don't conduct electricity, because of not having free electrons, like plastics. They are used to cover wires and plugs, to prevent from electric shocks. Lightning is a form of static electricity. During thunderstorm, electrical charge builds up inside clouds due to collisions of air particles. More and more charge builds up inside, and then discharges in the form of lightning towards ground. In 1752, scientist Benjamin Franklin tied a metal key to the kite's string, and flew kite in thunderstorm. When he touched the key, he felt a powerful electric shock. Franklin nearly died but proved that lightning was a form of electricity. Metal rods are used to protect tall buildings, from lightning by discharging charges to the ground. Our brain works using electricity. There are more than 100 billion neurons, which carry electric signals to different parts of body. When we read a book, light rays pass into eyes and change into electrical signals then lead to brain. Their signals are changed into images we can see. Sharks have special cells that can pick up tiny electrical signals, to sense world around them. Do you have more burning questions about science? Keep watching and click on subscribe.